Cherie from Soliloquies. So I wanted to talk a little bit about my art quilt process. I've been developing my style a little bit over the past few years, and I'm starting to use more mixed media in my art quilts. So a few years ago, I created a video that used simple line art as a design and cut out shapes on fusible backed fabric. And I liked it, but I felt like it was a little too limiting. So I started experimenting more with acrylics, with dyes, with ink tents, um, and I wanted to create more realistic looking animals and um, have a little more flexibility in my designs. So I'm starting to create more artwork that has kind of like these illustrative animals. Um, and I have the beaver quilt that I'm working on. So I've got some beavers that I um, painted and then I'm doing collage techniques. And I'm at a point now where I kind of want to challenge myself. Um, and I want to create these wildlife art quilts um, where I've got like all of these mixed media techniques and I'm creating more complex scenes and like animals kind of contextualized. Um, so I'm moving into kind of more free form, creative, artistic, illustrative styles of art quilts. So I'm starting to rely a little bit more on fabric colors, fabric textures, um, and the types of fabrics that kind of reflect nature and can be found in nature, some more natural looking um, patterns and colors um, and textures. And I'm kind of incorporating those into my designs so that I can get more of a naturalistic feel to my designs. So I'm gonna to try to create kind of shorter videos that show each of the steps of my process, um, starting with creating a design, um, choosing and preparing the fabrics, um, doing all of the collage applique work, um, adding some painting with acrylics and the ink tents, pencils, um, doing thread embellishments, thread painting, and then using quilting for form and texture. So I hope that you um, are interested in following me. Again, thanks for watching. Um, this is Cherie with Soliloquies. And don't forget to subscribe if you're interested in learning more about my creative process for creating art quilts.